Hello everybody, this is Forget Me Not and welcome back to Tokyo Mirage Session Sharp Fire Emblem Encore. In the last episode, we explored the first intermission of the game. We tried out the grinding dungeon thing that was added in the Encore version. We tried all three of its modes. And then we looked around the world for as many side quests as we could find. And in this episode, we're going to start Chapter 2. So with all that said, let's get to the video. Okay, here we are at the Uzume Lesson Studio. Every time you want to start the next chapter of the game, you come here and you enter the the red next button thing. First I want to see what Barry says. It looks like Tsubasa's sister came back safe and sound. Another victim of the mass disappearance returns to our side. It's almost time for your training. Come on in. All right, then let's go. Ending an intermission. During an intermission, entering the Uzume Lesson Studio will end the intermission and begin the next chapter of the main story. There's nothing in particular that you can only do in an intermission, so feel free to visit the Uzume Lesson Studio whenever you're ready to progress the main story. I usually like to hold off on progressing the main story until I do all the side quests I can, but that is just a personal preference. You can do whatever the frick you want. End the intermission and progress to the next chapter. Yes! So let's see what we got. Oh god, I miss Tsubasa. One, and two, and three! Alright, very nice! Let's take five, guys! That was pretty tough, huh? You seem pretty into this, Tsubasa. I can barely keep up! Now that I've got my first song coming up, I'm just really fired up, you know? so proud of her. I love her so much. Are you guys finished with your lesson already? God, I love Kiri. I love every- I love all of them so much! Kiri, what are you doing here? I decided I'll be your personal coach. Fashida! Sorry. I don't plan on going easy, though. Think you can keep up? Of course! If you're the one asking me, I'll go through any training. How about you, Itsuke? Huh? Me too! I did not sign up! Well, technically I signed up for this, but I didn't really sign up for this! Naturally. Alright, you two, let's get to it. Yes, ma'am! Coach! Miss! Ready for raining! Ready for raining! I'm ready too. <laughs> oh, there we go! Intermission end. Great. God, that song is so good! Oh, a star is born. Okay, chapter two. Head over heels for her. I wouldn't know. And so the day of Tsubasa's debut came! Gotta stay quiet for this one. It's her song! It's gonna be the whole music video! <laughs> I can't stay entirely quiet. She has such a good outfit! Move showing the secret identity of the magical girl in her music video. Magical girl Subasa right there. Oh. What you mean, Mary Tsuki? Mm. 
Mystery of the Disappearing Models? Yeah, guess I got curious. Models disappearing, huh? Actually, I'm kind of more surprised you read this stuff. Well, the headline got my attention. I just picked it up for the article on the live concert at the 106. Hey, cool! This has an article on Tsubasa, too! Man, now that I'm seeing Tsubasa in magazines and music videos, it's finally hitting me that she's a real idol now. Congratulations! Sounds too good to be true. Her debut song was the one she sang for Aya, Her music video was just the 106 craziness. <laughs> Miss Maiko was in danger at the time, but I have to wonder if some of this was all part of her plan. Wouldn't put it past her. Seriously! When did she have time to get footage of us? She's either really resourceful or just plain sneaky. But I guess for the guys in class, the music video was nothing compared to finding out Tsubasa has become an idol. Oh right, they're still in high school. Yeah, seems like she has crowds around her at every break now. They're still in school! How did I forget? They're still in school! They're still dealing with school on top of this! Unlike Persona games, it is it they don't actually show these people t attending school, but they still attend school! Sounds like she's given it all she's got. She's probably over at the lesson studio today, too. Why don't you go say hi? I bet if you drop by, her motivation's gonna skyrocket. Well, I bet if you drop by, her motivation's gonna skyrocket. You think? Yep, I do. Now go on, go give her a pat on the back or something. I think I will. Sounds like Nothing is a chore for my dear sweet Tsubasa. Good. So, the other option was sounds like a chore. It's always casual clothes have been added as a costume. Dark Argyle. That's just a cool phrase. Toma Akagi's ca yeah, casual clothes have been added as a costume. Urban Wild. That's a band name right there. Wait, oh, what, what? Welcome. And then we also have, huh, a, a mask. She's wearing a different colored uniform. Is she an employee here? She's standing at the register, but the register closed sign is still on display. Don't any of the other customers or employees notice her? Let's talk to her, and then we'll see Toma's message. Welcome to Hee Ho Mart! Oh, well, welcome to Hee Ho Mart! Ho! What? Not cashier. Is there some kind of special event going on? Hee Hee Ho! Hee Ho Ho! If you spoke to me, that means you can see me, ho! Could it be he that you're a Mirage Master, ho? Well, how do you know about that? Hee Ho Ho! Since you're a master, I'll sell you special items. There must buy items for heroes that fight against enemies from another world, ho! Talk to the curious looking Hee Ho Mart worker with the different uniform than the Hee Ho mask to purchase mystical items not available to the general public. These items are more expensive than many other items in the Hee Ho Mart, but they all have powerful combat or exploration effects. If you can afford it, browse the goods for sale. Hee Ho! How can I help you today, Ho? We Ho got mystical Hee items! I'll sell you whatever you need, Ho! Let's see what you got! Life Stone? They're basically the magic versions of the stuff at the shop, along with uh, one-use spells. Like the, we have spells called like Tarukaja and Rakukaja and stuff like that. These are one uses of that. So if you don't have anyone with that spell in your party, you can stock up on items and use them when you need them. I like having these. I'll get three of each. Yeah, magic mirrors and attack. Oh no, I can't buy attack mirrors. I can't afford them. It's fine. They're they're basically like reflect attacks, and they're nice. Oh, let's get a whole bunch of these, cause I missed them last episode. Yes. Okay, that's all I can afford. Thanks for buying. So he helpful. This is for being a gung ho ho customer. No marks. Anything else? So? Nope, I'm good. Thanks for your patronage, ho! Okay, let's get out of here. Oh wait, I forgot to talk to Toma. Let's do that now. Oh look! 
Look, Sumas is all over the. Sumas has posters everywhere. Ah, that's so cool. Okay, let's talk. Main story. Don't forget what we just talked about. You gotta help out Subasa when she needs it. She should be at Uzume Lesson Studio now. Sometimes I worry about you, man. You have these days where your head is just in the clouds. Hey, I'm doing my best. Let's go around this way. That is that that voice is fun to do. Like yo. Uh, let's go back to the lesson studio. Let's see Subasa. Hi! You gotta learn to dance with muscle memory. If you think about it too much, you're not gonna be able to sing too. Got it. All right, stop. That'll do for that'll do it for today. Oh, Itsuki! I love her. I love her. I love her. I love her so much. I forgot to Google the right options to take for the secret and the secret thingy, majiggy, but I will look it up after this episode. If I choose the wrong answers for anything, I will tell you in editing. How's everything going? Going good. After all that stuff with Aya, I just feel like a huge weight's been lifted off my shoulders. I'm enjoying every moment of dancing and singing now. I am so proud of you. This boss has improved a whole ton from before. Going by Dia Witch terms, I'd say, but I'd rank her at about episode seven. What's that mean? <laughs> I have no idea what that means. Shit! Well, anyhow, I'd say you're good to go now. What the? What is happening? Oh my God! I just remembered. Tomorrow's the Dia Witch game release day. The pre-order bonus is calling out to me. Say what you will about Dear Witch Inoha, but it's got a catchy theme song. I have to hurry and get in line for the midnight release. All aboard the hype train! Choo choo! So, wait. Was he actually praising me or. I think so? Oh boy. Oh boy, we're about to meet my favorite character! Are you done in here? Oh, sorry, we were just... What? Yashiro Sukuri! In person! You know him? Tsubasa? Listen to that. Mm, that theme. What? Know him? Dot dot. I asked a question, if you don't mind. Oh, right. Sorry about that. Your lesson just finished, so we'll be out soon. Lesson? It looked more like children to play than anything else. Play? Tsubasa's giving it her all. She's literally a fucking idol. Mm. I'm only giving you my honest appraisal. Dot dot dot. In any case, you two were getting in the way of my own training. Training a three-piece suit like that. If you wish to play your little games, do it somewhere else. This is a training room for professionals, not an amateur's playground. Amateur? hit song out right now! She's not an amateur. Tsubasa is an idol of Fortuna Entertainment, at the very least. Fortuna. And that would you... And that would make you a member of Fortuna as well? Huh, what's all this about? Once again, answer my question. Oh, he's such a bitch. I love him. Yes, I work for Fortuna. Yes, I'm a member of Fortuna too. Not that I'm an actor, singer, or anything like that, but I work there! Da da da. You're a rather strange one. It's got 
complicated. And none of your business anyway. Perhaps. Ah, Petra. Oh, he's such a bitch. I love him. C come on, Itsuki, let's go. We really shouldn't be interrupting Mr. Suguri like this. We're not interrupting shit. Hmm? Just a moment. You. Have we met before? M me? No, I don't think we have. I mean, maybe seen on TV, but... Never mind, then. You can go now. Yes, sir. For most of the game, during my first uh, playthrough of this game, I gave him the lovely, affectionate nickname of Bitch Face McGee. I will be using it in this playthrough. Phew, that got me scared for a second. Itsuki, what was with all that hostility? He's the one who started it. So he's Yashi Suguri, aka Bitch Face McGee. Because of that mirage attack, we never saw him at that joint concert. But the show he's starring in right now, Labyrinth of Love, is this season's number one hit, and he even sings the main theme. He's an amazing person. He's always at the top of the charts as a singer, and as an actor, he's called the Prince of Ratings. Doesn't make him less of a jerk! Doesn't change the fact that he's kind of a jerk. But if, really, if he's really as good as you say, I'd want to see his performance. <laughs> Ta-da! I got tickets for me! <laughs> Return the favor from the first episode! I got them from Miss Maiko. I've got one for you too, Itsuki. She told me that as a Mirage Master and a member of the entertainment business, I should try to experience all of the good things. That's pretty generous of her. Let's go watch it together. Oh, I just remembered I need to head to the office now. I'll see you later, Itsuki. I love her. I love her. I love her so much. Topic for Maiko. Hey, Subasa. I know the lessons should be over by now. I've been waiting for a while, you know. <sighs> if there's nothing going on, I need you to hurry back to the office. I've got something important to tell you. Okay, let's go. We can just, um, uh, map button. X. And then we just go to Fortuna Office. Go. And then, like magic, we are at the next cutscene. My, my second favorite character! Oh man, I need a voice for her. I've already used up all my little girl voices. Oh. Hello? Huh? Oh, hi. I heard about you from Miss Maiko. You're Mr. Itsuki Aoi, right? Yeah, it's me. And you would be? I'm Mamori Minamoto. Do you work here too? Yes, that's correct. So that means you've been here longer than me. Should I call you Miss Minamoto then? Oh no, just Mamori is fine. Um, I hope we can be friends. Of course. If you don't mind, could you tell me more about yourself? Because I have no fucking idea who you are. Well, I'm on a show called Microwaving with Mamori. Have you ever seen it before, Yitsuki? Sorry, I don't really watch TV. Yikes. Hey, most of the TV I watch is cooking shows. Oh, really? Yeah, but if you're in the show, I'll try giving it a watch. Thank you. Please tell me what you think about it once you do. Um, and I also like ballads a lot. I'm an aspiring singer. Or, well, I've already made my debut as a singer. Wow, that's amazing! No, it's really nothing that great. I I did release a CD, but it hasn't um, sold very well. Oh, but that doesn't mean I've given up. I'm still trying very hard so that I can get more job offers that involve singing. I'm so... 
I love her, I love her, I love her, I love her. I'll be cheering you on then. Thank you very much. Yeah, she's not... I'll have to put a little more kid in her voice. I'll figure it out. It's all a work in progress. There's so many anime girls! Oh no, we need to save Tsubasa from whatever is going on up here. Hi. Oh, Izuki. Tsubasa's just getting ready for her next job. Want to know what it is? Sure. Oh, she's, she's not happy about it. Are you nervous, Tsubasa? Yeah. I mean, I'm going to have to model for Nanno. That was a famous fashion magazine, wasn't it? Tsubasa, that's great! Feel was a huge hit. I keep getting new offers from big publishing companies. How could I pass this up? You'll be fine, Tsubasa. Everyone starts somewhere. Just walk on in, a newbie full of confidence and own it. <sighs> that's easier said than done. It really is. Like, you try, and then it's just like, oh, wait, I overstepped. Did I? Did I not? It'd be fine if I, it was just singing, but being a fashion model? There's no way I can do this. You look great in anything. I think you look great in anything, so I don't think you have anything to be embarrassed about. You think so? Well, that's nice to hear from you, Itsuki. <laughs> Yeah, no matter what you wear, you always look great. I, uh, 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 st stop! I don't know how to deal with you saying that! Huh? Well, in any case, I think you'd be able to pull it off. Miss Michael wouldn't have signed you up for this if she didn't believe in you, right? Oh. I guess you're right. Okay, I'll do my best. Good luck. Thanks, Itsuki. You helped me sort my thoughts out. Just as a side note, it's not just a shoot for Tsubasa. There are plenty of other models scheduled, too. As for the photographer, well, he's certainly skilled, so I'm sure the pictures will turn out great. Well, good luck on your first photo shoot. Okay. I love her, I love her, I love her. I love her dearly, I love her with all my heart. But who'd have thought it'd be him doing the photo shoot? I guess it's a small world. You know the photographer, Miss Micah? Mm-hmm. Nobu Horinozawa. He's a pretty famous photographer in the industry. They call him a man of true talent. Knows the perfect angle and timing to bring out the true beauty of his subjects. Or at least that's what they say. If you ask me, it's all thanks to the model. The model? That's right. Before all this, I used to be a fashion model, you know? W what, really? Well, I used to be a fashion model. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I worked with Hori Nizawa quite a bit back then, but he was pretty mediocre. A bit above average. Of course, he could have improved since then, so he may well be the top class photographer they say he is now. Top class? But if he's such a good photographer, why did you look so worried earlier? Worried? Itsuki, don't be ridiculous. I've got nothing to worry about. Oh, I almost forgot. Hmm? What's wrong? There was an article that caught my attention earlier. What kind of article? Apparently a lot of models have been going missing. Something about this seems suspicious. Hmm. You might be right. There's a chance mirages are involved in this. I'll use some of my connections and look into it. Thanks. After this though, I'm a little more worried about Tsubasa. Could you head to where she's working and play bodyguard? 
She'll be at the Daiba TV main building, the one with Daitama Observatory. Her shift should be in the studio nearby. Got it. I'm counting on you to look after Tsubasa. Of course we'll do anything for our girl. I love her with all my heart. Oh, we're against. Oh, urgent topic from Toma. Yo, Itsuki, got a sec. What's up? Just saw Tsubasa earlier. She looked really distracted. I saw her run into a telephone pole and then uh, she frantically apologized to it. It's worse than I thought. <laughs> Heard Tsubasa got a gig as a model with some photo shoot over in Daichama. Kinda worried about her. You wanna go keep an eye on her. I'm literally already on it, Toma. That's the plan. Miss Maiko already told me to head that way. Awesome. Make sure you help Tsubasa if she needs it. Understood. Let's go! Just, just, let me go! Daitama! Go! This is where it's happening! Right? This is where it's... Okay, this is where it's happening. Oh, hey! It's Mr. Mans! We saved him in the last dungeon! What's his name? Hat... Hat... Hatsun... Hatanaka. Oh! Wait a minute, you were at the 106, weren't you? I don't remember the voice I gave him. Oh, Mr. Hatanaka. Oh, I knew it. You're that boy who helped me out of that nasty jam earlier. And your name again was? Itsuki Ali. Ah, Itsuki. So, do you remember exactly what happened at the 106? I've been trying and trying to recall, but all of my memories feel like this dreadful haze. I feel like I was lost in some bizarre place, but somehow it feels like it was all just a dream as well. Truth be told, I don't even remember precisely how we met. Every time I try to recall, my thoughts feel so jumbled. Why can't I remember anything? Um, well... Oh! Oh, Weetsky, there you are! Work finished a little early, so I dropped by the studio where Subasa's doing her photo shoot. Whoa, Mr. Hatsunaka, always a pleasure, sir. Oh, now you, you were at the 106 as well, weren't you? Sorry, Mr. Hatsunaka, but we're running a little late. Itsuki and I gotta run. It was nice meeting you again, Mr. Hatsunaka. Uh, aha. Uh -huh. Until next time, then. I'm sorry, sir, but... <laughs> Traumatic, experience or, traumatic experiences are repressed for a reason. It sounded like Mr. Hatanaka was really curious about the idolosphere. Ah, oh, crap, really? Hope he doesn't stick his nose too far into this. It'd be dangerous if he got mixed up with Mirages. Yeah. Oh, right, Tsubasa's photo shoot. I've already been by the studio she was at it, but... Turns out there was some kind of trouble. I guess the shoot got cancelled. Trouble? Was it a Mirage? Nah, it didn't look like it. All the models were coming out safe and sound, so I think we're good on that front. But I did see the photographer, that Mr. Horinazawa. He looked really mad about something. Hope Tsubasa's- is... Hey! Well, speak of the devil. Check it out, that's Mr. Horinazawa over there. Hey, He's got a score. I'll see you later, then. Oh, look, it's Bitch Face! In the poster. So he's the photographer. Wait, back up a sec. Why'd you jump straight to Mirages? We were just talking about them. You remember the article in that magazine at the convenience store? About those models that went missing? Oh, yeah, that stuff. We don't know for sure if Mirages are behind it, but it's just been bothering me. So I talked to Miss Michael about it, and she sent me over here to make sure Subasa would be okay. I guess I wasn't really needed here after all. Though, I guess I wasn't really needed here after all, though. Well, there goes my plans for the day, anyway. I think I'll take a walk before I head back. See you around, man. Where is Subasa? Where is my girl? Where is my girlfriend? I want to see Subasa. Where are these guys? Dogensaurus is so cute. What color should I pick? 
My daughter loves Dogen the Sor Dogen Source, so the wife made me take her to see it. But it's nice just having a day out with her. Okay. So this poison gas attacks in Shibuya? I'm the only one who thinks it's terrorists. I guess I'm the minority. <laughs> it's not terrorists, it's magic. It's oh, there we go, urgent time for Micah. I don't know what that button did, okay. So, how was Tsubasa's photo shoot? It was already over when I got there. Apparently there was some kind of problem. Tsubasa should be back at the office safely now. That's a relief to hear. I actually just turned up some info on the models who disappeared. Apparently they all had photo shoots with Hori and Azabo before they vanished. It's hard to think this is just coincidence. You think Tsubasa could be the next target? That's what I'm worried about. I want you to keep a close watch on her for the time being. I'll head back to the office then. Tsubasa might be back by now. Thanks. I'll try digging up some more info on Horinazawa in the meantime. Okay. Guess I should head back! Let's go back to the office! Tsubasa? Oh good, she's here. Thank god. Okay. Oh, is that the witch thing? The yellow person? Oh no, she's sad. Oh no, Tsubasa is sad. That's bad. That's always bad. <sighs> What's the matter? Well, it's just... Today's photo shoot didn't go so well. I made the photographer mad and he just left. Everyone makes mistakes. What's important is that you learn from them. Like Megamind always says. Yeah. Oh god, I'm, I can see it now, running gag about Megamind. If there's something you want to talk about, I'm here. Sometimes it can help you put things in perspective. Thanks, Itsuki. And if it'd help to complain a little, I'll listen. Oh, so I can only complain a little, huh? Yep, a tiny bit. Okay. I messed up this time, so the only thing I can do now is make sure I don't make the same mistake again. I'm an idol now. There's a lot I'm going to have to deal with. But if I can overcome all of it, that's when I'll know I've made it. They said they'll try the photo shoot on another day, so when that day comes, I'll try even harder. On another day... What's wrong, Itsuki? Well, Horinazawa, that photographer who was running your photo shoot, there's some strange rumors about him! Strange rumors? Yeah, I heard this from Miss Michael, but it seems like quite a few of his models have gone missing lately? You mean, a mirage? Maybe, probably. It's an emergency! What's wrong? It's Shibuya. There's something strange happening. What's going on in Shibuya? The, the people in Shibuya aren't acting... The people in Shibuya aren't acting normal. What do you mean not normal? I don't know why, but everybody looks extremely tired and... Um, I... Uh... Calm down, Mom Marie. Take your time. Oh, look, there's her show. It's still mid-afternoon, but everything suddenly became dark and hazy. I, I got scared, and I rushed all the way back here. They keep showing her show. I'm glad you're okay, Ma Marie. I don't know exactly what's going on, but for the moment, we should head to Shibuya. Yeah. Ma Marie, it could be dangerous, so you'd better stay here. Okay. Please be careful, you two. Oh god, okay. Trouble on the trouble alert. Let's go to Shibuya. Let's just try the central city. Sure. Okay, yeah, just anywhere in Shibuya. It's all kind of fucked up. No! Her big old poster is all sad now. 
Oh, look, Tiki. Yeah, well, there's there's the and there's the entry to the Arndal sphere. Everyone's very upset. Everyone's very sad. Why does it always happen to Shivia? Why well, is the first one happened in Daitama? But like twice in a row. Oh. Oh my God. It's him. Nobu Horinazawa. Ah, oh, Maiko. You finally decided to return as my muse, then. I didn't want to believe it. So you really are the one. Return the people you've taken, now! Ha! Huh. No, I don't need to bother with those amateurs. I would only take pictures of what truly deserves to be immortalized. You. Let me help you remember that joy of everyone's eyes on you. And remember how you illuminated the world. Oh no. 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 Please no. No thank you. <gasps> no! Maiko! Miss Maiko? You. Where did you send Miss Maiko? No! No, 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 we were, we are in the same place, Subasa. Oh, shit, wrong button. There we go. Everyone? Oh, it's a group chat. Everyone, Mr. Hori and Hazawa's done something to make Miss Michael vanish. We need to go after him. Shibuya looks the same as that Civil Life incident. It has to be Mr. Hori and Hazawa who's causing this. Mr. Hori and Hazawa went towards Central City Street. We gotta be careful. Let's check on people. This guy's useless, huh? Maybe it's about time we broke up. Don't tell her I said anything, but this girl's real selfish. She wants me to do so much for her. It's exhausting. No. People are being mean to each other. Oh, Toma. We need to save Miss Maiko and quick. Still, the photographer was the bad guy after all. I'm glad your boss is okay. I don't know why, but I feel awful all of a sudden. Let's go, let's go. Oh, there's Tsubasa. Hey, Tsubasa. I don't think that's Tsubasa talking. Oh, Shibi is like this now. Let's stop that photographer and save Miss Maiko. Let's do so. Oh, let's check on, let's check on everyone. I don't know why, but I don't really feel like doing anything right now. Oh no, it's weird hearing the happy songs mixed in with the sad, sad music. Oh, are you okay, dude? What is this? My body has no strength. <laughs> it seems the real world has <laughs> decided to be um, all ominous and scary, too. That's probably my cute... Oh. Mr. Hori and Izawa must have gone through here. Hitsuki, what should we do? Let's head in. We have to save Miss Maiko. We have to chase after her right away. We could, or... We could save that for another episode. <laughs> Let's save the system so that I don't lose my progress. There we go, okay. We're gonna take care of that next episode because I'm pretty sure it's about to start thunderstorming where I am and I don't want to record through a big loud scary thunderstorm. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe, tell me anything you want to tell me. Tell me what you think of the story. Tell me what you think of what's been going on in the world because a lot of, a lot of weird stuff has been going on in the world. Tell me what games I should play. I'm about to, as soon as I stop recording this, I'm gonna, uh, finally play Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition for the first time, so, um, we'll see how that turns out. And, yeah, 
With all that said, I will see you in the next video. Don't forget me!